Google Cloud enables you to migrate virtual machine instances, custom images or disks from on-premise environments or other cloud providers to Compute Engine. There are several ways you can migrate workloads to Compute Engine, including migrate for Compute Engine, importing virtual appliances or importing virtual disks. In this video, we will focus on how to import virtual appliances and virtual disks. Migrating virtual appliances and virtual disks is best suited for small number of VMs. If you want to migrate a large number of VMs, check out Migrate for Compute Engine. The first scenario will cover importing virtual appliances followed with virtual disks. Virtual Appliance is a package that contains hardware configuration and disk images for a VM instance. Before you start a migration, you should always check if the OS is supported for migration, check if the OS is compatible for migration by running the pre-check tool, choose if you will use your own license keys or if you will use Google Cloud's pay-as-you-go model, set up a storage bucket, grant IAM permissions for the import operation. After we complete the migration prerequisites, we will do one of the following. Either export the VMs into OVA or OVA format and upload them to a GCS bucket, or export the virtual disks, which are in VMDK or VHD format, to a GCS bucket. Check out this documentation for more information on uploading files to a GCS bucket. For this example, we have already uploaded an OVF package and one boot disk to a bucket. Next, we import the OVF files into a compute engine. We can import machine images through a gcloud command or a compute engine API. We have two options when importing. We can either create an instance directly while importing the OVF or import it as a machine image, then create a new instance from that image. The command on the screen imports the virtual appliance directly into an instance. The source URI here is the path to the OVF directory. There you go. We have successfully imported an instance from a virtual appliance. The command shown here creates a machine image from this virtual appliances and these machine images can be used to create instances later on. There are many flags available for custom settings such as BYOL to specify bring your own license model, project to specify the project you want to import this image, zone to specify the zone in which image to be imported, guest OS features to enable one or more supported features. You can explore more of these flags in the documentation. There you go. We have successfully imported the machine image from the virtual appliance. Next, we will cover how to import virtual disks. Virtual disk is a file used by virtual machines that emulate an actual disk storage device. Migration prerequisites remains the same for importing virtual disks. We can import virtual disks using Google Cloud Console, Google Cloud CLI and Compute Engine API. In Google Cloud Console, go to create an image page Specify a name of the image. Under Source, select Virtual Disk. Browse the Virtual Disk file. Specify the operating system that is available in the imported disk. Then click Create to import the image. Congratulations! We have successfully created an image from the virtual disk. Check out the documentation to learn more about Compute Engine Migration Paths. Thank you.